Thank you for joining me today. My name is John Newby, John 2020, Paul This is the third video on the biblical Koine Greek alphabet. And today is going to be a complete review of the full 24 alphabet real quick. And then we'll have a, a quiz where you can pause the video and try to answer it as I mix up the, um, the index cards and you say them to yourself or out loud, whatever you want to do, and try to uh, correctly answer what the letter is. Okay, so now a quick review, okay? Alpha, Beta, Gamma, Delta, Epsilon, Zeta, Eta, Theta, <coughs> excuse me, Iota, Kappa, Lambda, Mu, Nu, C, Omicron, P, Rho, Sigma, Tau, Upsilon, Phi, Chi, C, Omega. Now, I'm going to hold them up and say them to yourself in order. Okay, that is complete alphabet silently. Now it's going to be mixed up, and I'm going to give them in order. In a, in a, you know, obviously, not in the order. Okay, do your best. Pause the video if you got to think. It's okay. All right, do the best you can. Restart the video if you got to. Whatever you got to do, man. All right. All right, here we go.
Okay, <clears throat> that's all 24 randomly shuffled and mixed. All 24 randomly shuffled and mixed. Okay. Again, so one more round. One more round. This is important. This is important. And like I said um, in my first video, um, I'm self-teaching myself Koine Biblical Greek. On a scale of 1 to 10, I'm probably a 3 or 4 right now. I can read it and I can translate some words. And the reason why is I feel that uh, whenever you want to get into apologetics, you want people to use what the scripture says. And whenever you can read it, I believe some, one, one person put it one time that reading the scripture in its original language was like king or bride without a veil. And I think that's, pr that's pretty accurate. Whenever I first read um, the, my first scripture and kind of figured out what it was saying in the original language, it, you know, the Bible says to worship God with all your heart, all your mind, and all your soul. And it's it's pretty cool. So I, I recommend it. It's very hard. It's a very hard religion. It's dead for a reason. I promise you that, all right? Okay. So now we're going to go in order. Alpha, beta, gamma, delta, epsilon, zeta, eta, theta, iota, kappa, lambda, mu, nu, xi, omicron, p, rho, rho sigma, Tau, Upsilon, P, or excuse me, Phi, Chi, C, Omega. Okay? All right. One more. One more round. You got it in you. You might be in seminary or something like that. You got to pass this. Okay? Or you just you want to read it like me. So you can feel good about yourself. All right? Here we go. Look at that backwards eye. There you go. I apologize. That's my bad. All right, that concludes the quiz. Watch these these first two, three videos over and over again until you get it right. It's just like math. You gotta gotta get the basics first. You gotta learn how to add and subtract and all that good stuff before you can go into division and all that and multiplication. Just this the same way. I recommend learning this language, especially if you want to get an apologetics and amateur apologetics like myself, or get into like the big leagues like the, uh, the major apologetics guys who. Who knows where God wants to move you? Just ask the Holy Spirit for guidance and wisdom. Because um, you're going to need it. This is, this is very tough. Um, but you can do it. And uh, I just recommend it. You drill, 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 drill. And, I'll, and on my future videos, I'm going to show um, some other learning tricks. So the next video we're going to do is going to be on some vocabulary. Okay, some vocabulary. Very, very easy, simple vocabulary. We're going to build that confidence up. So, okay. Um, again, I'd like to thank you for watching. And if you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section below. God bless you. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen.